Jones, it's late as night, and we're feeling... <laughs> what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. I'm Mike. That's Chris. What's going on? What's up? What's up? Oh, what a night. Oh, what a night. Woo Assassins, Ladies yeah. Night, Episode 8. Good episode. This was, a, this was a dope episode for more than one reason, Mikey. One yeah. being the whole, you know, reversing of the time, going back and forth. Like, yeah. I was like, but what? Uh, okay. But wait. I know. Uh, okay. It yeah. was it was great, man. I really yeah. enjoyed this episode. Um, a lot of stuff went down on this. Uh, we knew that gun would be trouble, man. They yeah, found Tommy's, that gun. Tommy's yeah, Tommy's kind of fucked. Uh, you know, in a couple different ways. Um, but uh, yeah, everybody somehow ends up at this at this uh, precinct at the uh, at the right time. You know, wrong, it was, well, wrong time, wrong time, yeah, right place, well, right time, yeah. whatever. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so here's here's some stuff. I have uh, I've got a funny little thing that I I found a little mi- a little mess up in the episode. We'll get to that in a minute. Did but, you? Uh, yeah. But here's the thing. Basically, okay. yeah, they the, the fight, you know, CG knows that she's got to keep it safe, so she decides to go put it in the precinct, gets herself caught. Very cool. Um, you know, uh, Zan's there. She's trying to get it. And then we finally meet the, the Metal Woo, who, once again, these Woo, I love how they're yeah. moving their power around. We, we meet the Metal Woo as, as a woman, and you find out, oh, you know, uh, all right, they okay. I guess that person can change out, right? Yeah. And then the other, and then they go and she goes to the cop, and then yeah, and it ends up being going into CG, which is really interesting. So yeah. again, these these powers, I think they're oh, and can control electricity. Yeah. Uh, I just I don't know. I like that a lot. Now you said to me that you were saying to I me say, off camera that the that that he sent that McCulloch sent the metal woo. To, so he gets it before Zan. Was that what you were saying? No, no, no. Zan. He was. Together. He was. He was using. Yeah. Well, they were. They were working the together. He was woo. using yes. everyone at his disposal to get yes. this fire woo because he knew. And, it was, but it was. It was for Zan, and that was her prize for. Oh right, to make is. her right. So so you know yeah. Tommy's Tommy's there, Jenny's there to help to bang him out. Uh, yeah. You know CG's there. Yeah. And she so now Zan and metal. Yeah. yeah. And I just thought it was a really cool, you know. Anytime you got a, a lockdown situation in a, in a, in, a, in a police precinct, this mm-hmm. is is pretty interesting. Um, yeah. And um, although it just looked like an office building, <laughs> it just looked like an office. <laughs> kind of did look like an office. It's just but, like I mean, I guess booking. Place, booking you know. was just at like a regular desk, and then there was like yeah. offices. But hey, yeah. man, I'm not a cop. I don't know. It could be, that could be a real thing. Yeah. Um, but I just wanted to. Uh, so here's here's a little a little mix up, little mess up that I saw, and and you can tell me if I'm wrong or not. But she texts, right? The metal woo texts on the phone. Just goes controls electricity, so they can control electronics, right? Yeah. The metal woo. Text by just wiping. I think I know what you're gonna say. The timestamp on the text said 1:14 a.m., but that's wrong because it was the middle of the afternoon when everybody was there. Remember, they went to the coffee truck. They got a coffee. She said, yeah. like, "Oh, hey, can I talk to you a second? And got got into the uh, the the woman who gave the folder to mm-hmm. uh, Frank, whatever yeah, his name Frank, is, the captain, yeah. whose wife left him, is leaving him obviously yeah, because he cares so much. Day. Which again is just we haven't seen him in a couple episodes. Kind of like a throwaway character. He just happened to be the way into the story. Fine, that's great. But yeah, dude, it said one fourteen a.m. on the phone. <laughs> I bet you they were like, "Damn it, that's the only shot we have of that shit." <laughs> well, well, I guess we're doing it. You know what I mean? But um, yeah, I mean that was so, dude. It was the middle of the afternoon. Am I wrong? Yeah, no, I I I didn't notice that. I guess I was maybe thinking something else. I don't what know. What were you thinking? I guess I know. I don't know. I've I have to uh, I have to uh, look back and go back see and watch that. I immediately noticed that it said one fourteen a.m. I'm 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 a ninety nine point nine percent positive. Yeah. That's what I saw. Hey, so I mean, you're focused I watching. Uh, yeah, I didn't go back and watch it, but anyway. The show. Uh, so you know, here's the thing. So Tommy gets stabbed. That was brutal. I thought I I miss I. I don't know, man. I'm sorry. I'm doing a lot of talking. I'll let you talk in a second. No, no, no. I thought he stabbed him in the in the artery in the leg. Which no, I forget, he stabbed him in the stomach. Yeah, which I forget that that artery. What is that? The fe- femoral artery. The femoral, the femoral artery. That gets yeah. cut. You're basically fucked. Oh right? yeah. yeah I yeah, thought he cut right. him there. I'm like, oh my god. I got so upset. I'm like, yo, he's fucked. But then I yeah. realized, oh no, no, no. He got him in the stomach. All right. So yeah. So he got him in the stomach, and I was like, that's not good. Jenny takes the fire woo. 
and she's holding it with the tampon or <laughs> for yeah, a sort of fucking funny, yeah. f- uh, the maxi pad, I should say. Yeah. Uh, which was which was kind of funny. I don't know how I feel about that though. Now, if somehow they get out of this situation with Tommy being able to be healed or saved or whatever the case is. Now, what is Jenny going to do? Are they going to have to make this goo again to get her to release the, you know, do you want, you don't want Jenny to be the one that Kai has to fight, do you? I mean. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. I was like, so oh, man. I'm like. Kai wasn't even man, in this episode. Know. No, he wasn't. Kai he wasn't. Was episode. Um, Pretty interesting. I mean, just for a split second, there was the, there was a flashback in the beginning of the episode where you notice um, Zan watching Kai give the box and the whooshin uh, uh, to CG. Right, true, true, true. Before they went off. So that was like a flashback of the previous episode. But um, yeah, you only saw him uh, for a split second. So yeah, this was basically an all-out fucking kick-ass fight. Um, oh, the lady fight. Yeah, ladies night, ladies fight yeah. night, I guess. Um, and just a shoot-up of a bunch of cops and stuff. At brutal, this dude, fucking... those stilettos, dude. Fuck yeah. yeah, it was cool brutal. when she was when she walks up and they're and they're scanning her with the metal detector thing. And yeah. They go to her shoes like, oh, she just has like these studded shoes. That's all it is. And then she comes off the elevator and she pops the, the, the heel off and it's a big spike, That's which was dope. So yeah, dope, it was dope. Man. I mean, listen, it was a lot of, I mean, she was, she's fucking, dude, she was just sh- murking people, bro. She was yeah. just shooting the shit out of people. Um, so it was uh, – while that whole cold, thing man. was going on, the metal woo was transferring into everybody in the whole freaking place. So, yeah, like you said, I agree with um, the woo abilities and how each uh, woo, um, uh, you know, elemental they can, has, yeah, they can yeah, has out, yeah. each individual thing. And I think that's cool because they're, they're, they're very different from each other. So that's obviously um, – But that uh, – dude, that yeah. fight, that fight between Jenny Zan and then CG, yeah. Yeah, I was cool. like – Oh, they barely contained her, man. And she stabbed mm-hmm. her in the... Why did she take that shoe off, though? Uh, yeah, she took off one shoe. She took off one. Maybe I, maybe at one point she was swinging at them or something. With no, them. Maybe she, that's- no, she absolutely just took it off herself. She just popped it off. And I... And... and I remember that, but I don't know I if was she like, maybe swung with it or something. No, she just... No, she popped it off and then, and then was kicking with that foot without it. Does she not... Did she not want to kill uh, CG. She, did, she didn't want to kill them obviously because then she wouldn't know where the thing is maybe that's what i figured but it it's at the time i'm like that makes sense that makes, yeah that makes yeah sense. at the time i was like why would then she where do were that? they they wouldn't know where the the whooshin uh fire right but is. she needed to kick though you know so yeah she didn't want to just so get she overwhelmed, gets stabbed but... and then here's the thing mcculloch learned you know heals her heals her so i'm sitting here going wait a minute i didn't i i didn't this is the we didn't re- i I didn't really know that he could heal others that way. Mm-hmm. I only knew that he we what we knew before was that the woodwoo can heal it himself or herself. Yeah. That's it, because he, he wanted another, to bring his family another, back to life and he couldn't. But cool in, ability, right? But in yeah. five hundred years, he learned how to manipulate it. So that's what you get. So yeah. So so and then and then finally, the metal woo takes CG at the end, and you know, so Jenny's fire woo, CG's taken over. Very, very interesting. Yeah. Very, very cool episode. I just, I, I'm in, I enjoy these scenarios and I enjoy the fights, the people in the fights. Again, no music in the fight and mm-hmm. things like that. Like, I just really enjoy it. I, 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 I'm into it. I'm really into the show. It's, it's, it's really, yeah. really cool. Um, I like the scene with Tommy in the holding room being blamed for killing the dudes at KTV. He was just like, yeah. listen, I, you won't believe me. I, 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 like, what do you do in that situation? Like, yeah, you, you know, yeah, no, the truth. I mean, yeah, it's a, it's a lousy situation to be in. I mean, how about the fact before he even got picked up when he noticed that the guys were coming after him, he's like calling his sister quick, yeah, leaving her this message yeah. so she would find out. Um, Hey, I think I'm going to be uh, yeah, getting arrested, getting arrested right now. Moment. So, so come get me. yeah. So, I mean, listen, I'm, I'm uh, I mean, the screen cuts to black. Jenny has this big ultimatum. What is she going to do? She's the fire woo now. Um, she's looking at McCullough, she's looking at the, the metal woo, um, and Zan standing in front of her. So it's kind of her, um, alone at this moment in the precinct. So yep. again, the screen goes to black. Let's see what happens in episode nine. Uh, it's been a little rough because we always wanted to do these episodes, uh, you know, by episode, by episode, by episode. So, 
for us, for me and you, really not to binge this whole thing. You know, when did this come out? This came out, uh, what, the 8th, I think it was, of August, right, yeah. or something like that? Yeah. So it's been like a month, and finally we're just kind of finishing up. So there were many, many times I just wanted to shoot through this whole thing because this, each episode makes you, you know, want to well, watch the next. I know. Well, you so. got two more. Burn, burn through them. Let's get, yeah. let's get a there. Lot of, I want to see how it ends. Yeah, a lot of self-control it took for me not I to I want to see how it ends, but hey. So you guys but, stuck it out with us and we're doing one yeah. by one because we, you know, we wanted to give it, we wanted to give it that, you know, yeah. just, we want to talk about well, each it's tough. I mean, for me, especially I like, like, I don't want to merge and mix episodes and spoil anything for anybody yeah. that hasn't watched, um, the whole thing, because that's why we're, you know, if you're watching episode three of our review and we splurt some shit out from episode five or something, you're not going to be probably happy with us. So that's why I think we we've been pretty people. good. I, yeah, no, I, I think, think we've, we've been, been I think good. we've been pretty good also. So I'm glad um I'm kinda glad we did it this way. Yeah. Um a lot of self control, like I said, for us not to just binge this whole thing right away. But anyway, let us know guys. I think we're done, right? You got anything else, uh, Chris? No? Nope. Uh let us know what you guys are thinking about Woo Assassins in the comment section below. We love hearing from you guys, so please write in there. We enjoy getting um getting those comments thirdpersonpod.com in the Google searches brings you right to our YouTube channel. You can see all our other stuff that we're doing, our awesome interviews. If you're Badlands fans, we had awesome interviews with Daniel Wu himself, Sherman Augustus, a uh, bunch Lewis of Tan. The, Lewis Tan, the, of course Lewis, uh, who's in Wu Assassins. But we just have some awesome stuff on there. We're also doing AMC, um, the, the Terror Infamy. So it's all, another creepy uh badass new series so we got a lot of cool stuff in there so thanks again for for watching yep we'll see you in the next episode of assassins good night Peace.